Have you ever wondered what it's like to be inside of a spherical mirror? Well, welcome to Mirror Drop, the game that attempts to answer that. It's very trippy and I meant to navigate this somehow. <laughs> oh boy. Whoa. You can kind of control the gravity as well? They almost function like magnets. Oh. Ah. I got the world to go to its goal. That's the case. I can send it over there as well. Oh, but I gotta send it from like below. So I turn this off and it goes into the bubble. That's the goal of the puzzle. So it's like half figuring out the rules, half navigating this absolutely demented space. Oh, but this is interesting, right? I could start here, put it in the middle, select that and send it there. So it kind of goes to the midpoint of all of them. And what is this? Woo! Oh, that's a level complete. One down. God, this is so weird, but so cool. Where am I now? This appears to be a normal square, or is it? There's more of these potential goal things. Yeah, so I have to have this be the goal, but is this toggleable? It is, that's the lights. Oh, I can select the edges. It's, oh, I'm in a cube, I understand now. Okay, this helps me see a lot better. It's very trippy. Can I see myself? No, I have no physical imprints, but look at that. That is undeniably cool. Okay, so I gotta get it to the bubbles again. And it's attracted like that. So if I wanna get to that corner, I've gotta turn off these two and it goes down to that corner. And if I want to get to this one, I have, think it just has to share the two walls that it's touching. Maybe drag it over. Kind of balance it in the middle. There we go. It's in. Oh, this looks so weird. Just focus on this. I think I won. I love navigating this. I see how this could be uh, difficult to look at for some. I don't know though. This is absolutely cool to look at for me. Oh, big hall of mirrors. Looks like I'm meant to go up there. What can I all select? Okay, so I can select the walls and the center. Control the gravity. So if I want to send it up, I got to go up here. And then I can centralize it like that. Ringed planet. No, there's another goal in the corner down here. I see now. So I got to repel it from this wall. Repel it from the ceiling. Attract it to the floor. Repel it from that wall, and there it is. And there's another go way over there. So attract it to the far wall. Repel it from the near wall. Then I gotta send it basically left from here. So attract it and it's in. I think I did it. Oh! <laughs> I didn't take anything before playing this game, right? Ah, damn, the gravity on this is so strong. Is this meant to be entered? That's because I beat it. The floating, like, sap drop. What's this cube in the corner, huh? I'm not sure what it wants to do. Okay, but again, I gotta retract it towards that thing. Why does a cube in the corner change anything? I don't know. Oh, hold on. That's not the midpoint of the room. If This is the midpoint. So it's like at the three quarters point over. So maybe I'm supposed to use the block as an offset. Let me show you what I mean, right? I, I turn off the magnet there. I turn off the magnet there. What happens if I turn off the magnet here? It runs into the block, right? So then it's gonna stay. Oh, no, 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 no. I need to go back. Go back, go back, go back. Turn this off. It's still there. I gotta turn off this wall. So now if it goes up, it will stay. It won't get magnetized in any way. It will be three quarters of the way between one and the other. And then I can make it to the little mist thing. Aha! And that's how I get to the other ones as well. I gotta magnetize all the way over here. And then hit the block as well. Even it out. And then bring it all over to this misty thing. There we go. One more. And that would mean using the final unused face of the block. Bring it all the way down and then offset it on the block. Fix the offset, bring it more over that way. Bring it all the way over to this wall and then bring it all the way up. There we go. Oh, oh my. Do I escape through this? I do. I'm in a pentagon. Am I inside of like a D12? No, how many walls is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, 
7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I'm on the inside of a D12. Very bright and pretty lights. Okay, so I gotta figure out geometry to get to these goals again. This one looks pretty hard, actually. Even though it's really close. I'm gonna turn off all of these for starters. And then this one. Okay, that works. It's certainly beatable with trial and error. How about I go for this back edge one now? I mean, that one looks like it's just the intersection of two walls in particular. So I just gotta delete all the... Oh. I got it. Never mind. And there was another one, right? Right in the middle. This is the hard one. Like, what if I line up the two objects and then observe what I might have to work with here? Well, this has to be off. Can it be, like, double off? Or maybe these would all be off equally? Now, that moves it too far, but then what if I turn this back on? Did it work? Oh, it's right there! Okay, maybe if I turn this off? Aha! So you line them up, and then you can kind of balance it out that way. Trippy. They're balls. Everything's balls. There are some facts in life you come to learn, and that's just... Everything is balls. That is infinitely repeating. Long hallways, and a lot of them. Here's my issue, though. What can I do? Is this even a goal? Oh. That makes sense now. And I have only more questions. Where am I? Oh. Oh? Oh, what the hell? I don't know what I'm in, but it feels like some of my controls have been taken away from me. What is this symbol, this hook? It's a mirror. These are walls. And you need to go in. I guess there are offsets. Like if I drop this. Okay, there we go, and I brought it down. Oh, okay, now it's over here. Now, if I bring it a bit left, it's in. And I think I appreciate that, oh, I almost appreciated that it zoomed me out. I don't know how to feel about it right now. That's a long, long way around. Just keep swirling it. Keep dragging it over. And then up. Yeah, that wasn't too bad. Ooh. Dude, how do you even come up with this imagery? This is mad impressive. Oh, it feels like it's gonna swallow me. Whoa. What the hell? Wiggly lines. <laughs> okay. Alright, I gotta figure out how to get out. Maybe back up a little, see what happens. It's like a question of what if am I even in? Okay, I have a new goal. You can see the question mark thing has a little dot at the bottom of it. And I can kind of understand where I am right now. I mean, does anyone ever really know where they are at any given moment? That's tough to say. But it kind of looks like... It kind of looks like I'm approaching it. Kind of looks like I'm moving towards it. But that has to be my goal. I just have to master the controls and get myself slowly towards it, because I'm not pressing forward to go forward here. I have to press left to move towards it. I think this is what I want. Fuck. Are you serious? Maybe it's behind? Oh? You were hidden behind there. In the question mark, you cheeky bastard. Did you do space to go up and left to go forward? And up to go to the right? What the hell? I'm in a hall of windows and mirrors. Yes, it does look like there's multiple rooms. This is a goal. And that was me. Okay, so it looks like there's two rooms? Yeah, two rooms with doors. And that's... Ah. Oh, that's a wall. Oh, I see now. Okay, hold on. Ah, I understand. Okay, it's trapped in the corner. Get it out of the corner. Whoa, sent it to the other side. It kind of zigzagged a little. Hold on. Well, it's in the room now. Tracked it to the ball. 
Oh, do I have to use these walls to help hold it in place? Because, yeah, if you line it up, it lines up really closely to the edge of this wall. So how do I get it to stop on that wall? Can I drag it back through here? I can. Hold on. So now I could send it. Let me try sending it up first. It's in. It's annoying I can't see it go in because I have to touch the wall, but... If I bring it back to the center, then bring it to the right, and then hold it there, and then send it across, it'll go in that way. That's two, usually there's three. Uh, I see the third one. It lines up clearly, like, with the height of the door from this angle. So if I bring it back into the door itself, and then bring it down? Yeah, I gotta turn that off. Bring it down, it's at the correct height now. And now to hold it in place, and then bring it over. Bring it over again. Bring it over a third time and it's in. That's three, what are you doing? What are you doing? I'm getting out of here. Or does it anything crazier? All right, where do I go? Here I am. Is that my goal over here? It is. The long hallway of eyeballs? Eyeballs that are always looking at me. Oh. What the hell? Can I go in? That's a mirror. What about the eyeball? I can go in the eyeball. And there's a goal way out here. Oh. I can attract it. Is there anything else I can turn on? Currently, no. We will turn it off. Let it rest in the middle. Are we sure I can't go in this? Yeah, I guess we are sure. But there's only... Oh, I can turn off this wall. Hold on. It's stuck here, so maybe it can go the long way now? Oh, yeah, it can go all the way over here now. It still doesn't go down to this, though. I can move it up within the sphere. Maybe turn off this wall. Oh, but it stays balanced. Okay, what if I turn off this? Turn on the ceiling? Aha! There we go. I finally got one. All right, new idea. I got to get it inside the border first. So I'll balance it in the middle. Send it to the middle of that. And then I need to turn off this wall and just send it up or down. It passes right through these, though. Send it over this wall. Maybe bring it up. Bring it up within the eyeball. Well, maybe bring it down within the eyeball. It might be at the correct height now. Stop. Okay, it's, it's held at the correct height. I'll bring it on over to the middle. All the way over. It's in now. How do I get it just a little bit up, though? I mean, if I hit the ceiling, it goes way up there. And it's super white now. I have no real plans yet. Maybe I got to use the inside of the eyeball to help me out. Up again. All the way back. Got to drop it. Hold its height. It's got to be held now, right? It's got to be held at height. Count it. <laughs> I feel like it just gave it to me. Oh, boy. Maybe behind the mirror, now that the wall's opened up. Oh, I can see how they're connected. Oh. The true geometry of the place has revealed itself, and so has the exit. Very carefully hidden, I guess. It's like a bunch of gumball machines from this angle. Anyway. Well, that was trippy. This is cool to play, but I'm gonna be honest. It might be too nauseating to keep on YouTube, but the game's called Mirror Drop. It's quite fun. Thank you all for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you all in the next video. Have a wonderful day and peace.